my own rechargeable battery pack in here with this battery holder. With this battery holder, because it holds eight cells, so you when you put in five cells, you have to find out the right contact so that it will make the correct connection. In this case, the positive is here and the negative is at the end of the clip over here. So when I connected these batteries, I checked it because it works. So you see the light going on. These battery packs or these NC batteries are already charged. So it lights up. So what I'm going to test now is just to see if there's anything wrong with the circuit board. So I'm going to just plug in the solar panel and let it charge for a few hours to see if the voltage is going to go up on the battery pack here. It is about 7 volts now which is already charged. It should go up to maybe 7.2, 7.5, something like that. Oh. I charge it with the solar panel and it's working now. If the remote sensor and the electronics that turn on the light at night, if they don't work, forget it. I don't think I can fix that. But if it's just the battery, these are very low capacity batteries anyway. They're 600 milliamp hour. Uh, these are a little bit higher capacity. Plus, if any single cell don't work, I can just replace one of them. I don't have to replace the whole pack. So, all I have to do is put the battery separately into a case. I have to find a small size case and then just mount it to the wall. And that would be it. Thanks for watching.